Today's dish, we're pairing the filet with a lemon garlic scampi. For the garlic shrimp scampi, we're gonna start with one pound of extra large shrimp that has been shelled and deveined. We have four cloves of garlic, two that have been crushed and two that have been thinly sliced. We have a quarter teaspoon of red pepper flakes. You have a tablespoon of freshly squeezed lemon juice and a quarter cup of dry white wine. Whenever cooking with wine, remember, use a good quality wine, one that you enjoy drinking. We have a teaspoon of salt, a quarter cup of unsalted butter, three tablespoons of chopped parsley, and we're gonna use about three tablespoons of olive oil altogether. Okay, now we're gonna marinate the shrimp. I've added the shrimp to a Ziploc bag. I added one tablespoon of the olive oil, the salt, and the two cloves of garlic that was crushed. You make sure it's all well coated. We're gonna pop this in the fridge for 30 minutes to let it marinate. Okay, we're gonna add the remaining two tablespoons of olive oil to a pan that I have on medium to high heat. Now we're gonna add the marinated shrimp to the pan. We're gonna cook the shrimp for about a minute on each side. Okay, now the shrimp have cooked about two minutes. We're gonna remove it from the pan and we're gonna to continue to make the sauce. Now we're gonna add the sliced garlic and the red pepper flakes. We're gonna cook this for about a minute. Make sure it does not burn the sliced garlic will burn very easily if you're not watching it. Okay, now we're gonna add the butter, and I've just sliced it in pieces just to melt faster. We're gonna let this go, and just every now and again give your pan a swirl, and we're gonna let this sauce thicken up a little bit. This process is gonna take about five minutes. As you can see, you just give it a shake every now and again or a stir. It's starting to thicken up and that's what we want. As you can see, the sauce has thickened up. It's been cooking for about five minutes. So now we're gonna add the shrimp back into the pan and let it cook about another two minutes until the shrimp are completely cooked. Okay, now the shrimp are back in. We wanna make sure that it's all coated and we're just gonna let these cook for about two minutes until it's, the shrimp are completely cooked. Okay, now that the shrimp are done and plated, now we're just gonna sprinkle them with the parsley and they're ready to be served. Thank you for joining us today. I hope you enjoyed this recipe. And if you would like to join us on our food journey, make sure you subscribe.